Hi, I am Valder Beebe. I am the host and the visionary of That Celebrity Interview. Diamond, thank you so very much for joining me today. How are you today? Doing great. Thank you for having me. Well, thank you for joining us here live in Dallas, Texas. I want my audience to know that Julia is the travel junkie. She hosts the words travel on National Geographic Adventure, and she's the author of The Travel Junkie, A Badass Guide to Travel. Okay, love that title. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you know, we're in the middle of traveling. It's summertime. I know you know that. I want to get us uh, uh, some information. So tell me if, will it, if I get a copy of the Travel Junkie book, what is it going to tell me about traveling? Uh, well, my book is filled with tips and tricks I've learned um, across the 80 countries I've been to through all seven continents. So plenty of advice for you on your next trip. Okay. So what I'd like to get advice on, I <laughs> see people come back from my vacation, even my team. They are worn out when they get back. <laughs> So, how can they have a great vacation and come home rejuvenated? I think one of the best ways not to have you know so much stress is to book a vacation rental. Um, with vacation rentals, you get extra space, separate bedrooms, which is great, especially if you're traveling with the kids, um, and fully equipped kitchen facilities, so you save money on having to go to restaurants. Uh, Wyndham Vacation Rentals has some beautiful properties, you know, all across the U.S. And it's actually National Vacation Rental Month, so now is the perfect time to check out uh, WyndhamVacationRentals.com. Okay, so give me some best tips for earning rewards for my vacation. You know, I, I think that's the, the topping on the ice cream. Well, I'm a huge fan of loyalty rewards programs. You know, getting a good credit card that earns you rewards and then you can redeem them for vacation, I mean, it seems like a no-brainer. Um, so there's a great a Visa card, the Wyndham uh, Rewards Visa card, which will uh, help you do that. And then you can redeem your points at over 25,000 resorts, hotels, or Wyndham properties all around the world. Um, you can earn up to 13 points per dollar on qualified stays. And so that means your points, you can rack up your points quickly. And plus, you also have member perks. So when you're at your vacation, you know, in your, in your hotel, you can get those preferred rooms, late checkouts, which is key. I like to sleep in, not sure about you. Uh, and you also get free Wi-Fi. So all those things, you know, just make your stay a little bit more pleasant. Love to stay in. But we start at the end of the vacation. Let's start at the beginning. Where do you start planning this vacation? Number one, inspiration. You know, where do you want to go? And number two, organization. What are you going to pack? What are you going to wear? All those items. So I'll make a checklist and put everything from raincoats uh, to sunscreen. And there's actually a brand new sunscreen on the market. It's called Honu. It's pretty different from the other sunscreens you've seen because of this cool patented um, spray wand. So you'll see right here that it moves and it's kind of cool, it's, it's unique. And the goal is that it, it provides coverage for those hard to reach places. So you know those times you're at the beach and you can't quite get that spot on your back? Uh, well, this will help. And it also has this reef-friendly technology, um, which means that there aren't certain ingredients um, in the sunscreen, so you're not like ruining the ecosystem of the places that you're visiting. So that, for me, to re re really um, practice responsible tourism is key as well. All right. So you and my photographer have been around the world. Okay, I'm going to say that. But so, give us some great destinations to consider for a vacation, those of us who go to the same place all the time. Well, if you're considering destinations in Europe, um, I would urge you to check out Copenhagen in Denmark. Um, it's a really cool city, cutting edge design, lots of history, and a really strong food and restaurant scene. Um, it's one of the cities that has the most Michelin star restaurants. So if you like to eat like quality, amazing food, um, Copenhagen is a really cool spot. All right, then. So any other suggestions to start planning their holiday travels now? 
Yes, just get out there. You know, go to go to um, sites like Google Flights and start researching what airlines go to your desired destination. Uh, check out Hopper, which is a really handy app that helps you decide if you should buy your flights now or if you should wait a little bit, helps save a little bit of money. Um, and also just to organize your trip, a handy tool is TripIt. So this will help you put all of your flights, your accommodations, your car rental, all your travel information into one simple itinerary just to keep you organized. You know, that'll really help uh, de-stress your, uh, your vacation. All right, guys. I see all your questions on Facebook, but I can't keep her forever, so you're going to have to get the book, A Badass Guide to Travel, or you're going to have to watch your own National Geographic Adventure Channel. Julia, let me ask you, where can they go for more information about these vacations? Yes. Well, you can check out my website, juliadiamond.com, or you can go to tipsontv.com. All right, you've got us all ready to travel. Do your diamond come back so I can let you know some of the places we've gone to. Thanks for being my guest on the Velder BB Show.